Daniel, the Tiger's neighborhood. Well, hello, Tigers. Hi there. Hi, Mr. Owl. Thank you. You're mighty welcome. Ooh. Did you like it? Uh-huh. And Margaret liked the pictures. Can I go get another book? That's why we're here. Let's go find a book to take home. Hi, O. <laughs> Hi, Daniel. Don't you just love the library? Yeah. There are so many books. Woohoo. See? Book, 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 book. <laughs> <laughs> you love books, O. Hoo hoo. Now I need a new one. Me too, hoo hoo. Ooh, a book about trucks. Honk honk. I read that one. A whale book, hoo hoo. I read that one too. Ooh, a book about spiders. I read that one. Hmm, read that one. Read that, read one. that one. Read that one. That one too. <gasps> oh. Hey, this book looks funny. <laughs> yes. I I'm want this book. This one. Hey. hey. Can't you read another book? Ooh, no, I want to read this one. Can't you read another book? Hoo hoo. No. Grr. Grr. Hi, boys. Everything okay? No. no. I want to read, read this, this book. dinosaur book. Hmm. You both want this book. Well, what about sharing the book? Sharing the book? I could read the book to both of you here. Sharing with you is fun for me, too. Sharing with you is fun for me, too. We'll all look at it at the same time. Ooh, I like that idea. Me, too, Hoo Hoo. Well, then, it's decided. But I will need your help to read it, okay? Okay. Okay. Will you help, too? Terrific. Thank you very much. Now snuggle up and let's read. Run, Dinos, Run by Brianna Saurus. Apatosaurus and T Rex were best friends. One day, the dinosaur friends decided to have a race to see who was the fastest. Ooh. They raced through a lake. T Rex was fast, but Apatosaurus was. faster. They raced up a mountain. This time, Apatosaurus was fast, but T-Rex was... Faster! And when they ran toward the finish line, their dinosaur friends all cheered, which made Apatosaurus and T-Rex both run even... Faster! Faster, faster, faster. hoo-hoo! <laughs> then, Apatosaurus and T-Rex crossed the finish line at the very same time. They were both fast. The end. I love that part. Me too. My grandpa gave me these stickers. See? <laughs> Do you like stickers? I really like stickers. These are special stickers because they're all things that go fast, fast, fast. <laughs> like, uh, this sticker is an airplane. Whoosh. And this one is a car. Beep, beep. And this sticker is a boat. Toot. This is where the stickers go in this book. Let's tell a sticker story. You can help me, okay? Okay. Once upon a time, there was a big lake with lots of water. Hmm. What sticker should I put in the water? <gasps> the boat. Sticky. <laughs> Okay, so one day, a brave Captain Tiger took his boat sailing on the water. He was looking for a friend, but when he sailed around on the water, he didn't see any other boats. He was all alone. But then, he did see a friend on the road. Hmm, what drives on the road? <laughs> the car, beep, beep. So the car was driving down the road. Captain Tiger said, excuse me, you on the road. Will you be my friend? And the car said, beep, beep, which is car for yes, I will be your friend. And Captain Tiger was so happy. Beep, beep. Hi, Margaret. <laughs> beep, beep. Yep, a car says beep, beep. Beep, 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 beep. No, no, Margaret, these are my stickers. Dan Dan stickers. Oh, oh, oh. <gasps> Margaret wants my stickers. <laughs> no, Margaret, no. These are my stickers. 
they're not for you. No! Hey, 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 what's going on? It's all right, baby Margaret. Tell Margaret she can't have my stickers. Oh, I can see you're upset. Why don't I keep the stickers safe while we talk, okay? Okay. So Margaret wants to play with your stickers, huh? Uh-huh, but they're mine. The stickers are yours. But it might be fun to play with your stickers together. Sharing with you is fun for me, too. Try giving her a sticker and see what happens. Sharing with you is fun for me, too. Well, okay, maybe just one sticker. Here you go, Margaret. Car sticker for you. Because <laughs> you like to beep. Beep, beep. where the sticker goes. <laughs> Car on your nose. <laughs> beep, beep. <laughs> okay, Margaret. <laughs> the sticker goes here. You want me to put the car in the tree? <laughs> okay. <laughs> beep, beep. I'm driving in the tree. <laughs> How about a boat sticker? Okay. Let's put the boat up da, 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 da. here <laughs> in the sky. <laughs> A flying boat. <laughs> it is funny, Margaret. So funny. <laughs> Dad, look how silly this is. A boat in the sky? A car in a tree? That is very imaginative. <laughs> Margaret did it with me. She's funny. Sharing with you is fun for me. <laughs> We're making music. <laughs> We're the Tiger family, and we love to sing together. <laughs> Margaret singing. Okay, Margaret, get ready for a big finish. We're the Tiger family. Oh, nothing could be better. And the Tiger family band will now perform Twinkle Twinkle. Okay, Margaret. Are you ready? <laughs> twinkle, twinkle, little. Goo! Goo? <laughs> no, Margaret. Star. <laughs> How I wonder what you. <laughs> Margaret, I wonder what you are. <laughs> You're so funny. <laughs> Up above the world so high, like a diamond in the. Sky! Yes, Margaret! You did it! <laughs> Let's go on a ladybug safari Through the tall, tall grass Climb up the giant rock Skip across a puddle fast Hide under giant mushrooms Play games with giant beetles too Our ladybug can crawl anywhere Or spread her wings and fly Play with Prince Tuesday. He always has fun things to do. But I felt really sad when my mom couldn't stay to play. I was happy and sad at the same time. Sometimes you feel two feelings at the same time. And that's okay. Sometimes you feel two feelings at the same time. I was so excited. I got frustrated when it fell to the ground Excited and frustrated at the same time Sometimes you feel two feelings at the same time And that's okay Sometimes you feel two feelings at the same time And that's okay Float, float, float in my bubble Float up in the air 
can see ducks as they float on the pond. The carnival looks like so much fun. I can see the carnival as I float by. I love the view as I float in the sky. I'll float, float, float in my bubble. Float up in the air, my bubble. And me. Sometimes you feel two feelings at the same time. And that's okay. I was at the carnival one day. There were rides to ride and games to play. I saw the Ferris wheel high up in the sky. I was excited, excited, excited to ride, but also a little scared, scared, scared at the same time. Sometimes you feel two feelings at the same time, and that's okay. Sometimes you feel two feelings at the same time, and that's okay. Sometimes you can say that you feel two ways. I was having fun playing my ring toss game, but when I missed, I missed, I missed. I got frustrated at the same time. Sometimes you feel two feelings at the same time, and that's okay. Sometimes you feel two feelings at the same time, and that's okay. It's Dino Day! It's Dino Day! It's Dino Day! Hey, hey, hey! Dinos can jump, and dinos can run. Playing with the dinosaur is so much fun! Dinos are big and dinos are tall. It's fun to play dinosaur basketball. It's Dino Day! It's Dino Day! It's Dino Day! Hey, hey, hey! Let's read a book together. Sharing can make a story better. It's more fun to do puppets with you. It makes our show terrific, too. Building sand castles yourself is fine. Or share and build them way up high. You can share with me. I can share with you. Sharing with you is fun for me, too. We can play together all day long on a swing or a seesaw. You can make music with your friends. You can share some instruments. A drum, a kazoo, or just clap your hands. Play them all together and you'll have a band. You can share with me. I can share with you. Sharing with you is fun for me, too. Sharing with you is fun for me, too. Yeah! <laughs>
me happy, and when I'm happy, I like to clap. I'll clap to the left and clap to the right. Clap to the left and clap to the right. Pretending makes me happy, and when I'm happy, I like to jump. I'll jump to the left and jump to the right. Jump to the left and jump to the right. This is my makes me happy and when I'm happy I like to dance I'll dance to the left and dance to the right dance to the left and dance to the right this is my happy song and I can sing it all day long this is my happy song and I can sing it all day long Remember our classroom jobs chart, right? Yep. I remember, Hoo Hoo. The jobs are plant water, bunny helper, uh, lights helper, line leader, and uh, lunch helper. Line leader. That's the job I want. Last week, you all had different jobs. 
And now, it's time to find out what your new job will be for this week. I will make sure that everyone gets a chance to try every job at some point. Everyone's job is important. We all help in different ways. Everyone's job is important. We all help in different ways. Our first job is plant waterer. This helper will water the plants to help them grow. And the plant waterer this week will be... Woohoo! It's me! Just what I wanted! The next job is Snowball the Bunny's helper. The bunny helper will clean Snowball's cage and give him food and water. And that job is for... Me! I royally love Snowball the Bunny. The next job is Lights Helper. This person will turn off the lights when we leave the classroom. Meow, meow! Thank you, everyone. I will be your lights helper. Our next job is line leader. I really hope I'm the line leader. And this job will go to... Me! Miss Elena? But that's the job I wanted. Hmm. The last job is lunch helper. The lunch helper gives out the lunch boxes when it's lunchtime. And that job goes to Daniel Tiger. Lunch helper? But that's not the job I wanted. Grr. Okay, class, time to leave the meeting area. So, line up behind the line leader. That's me. Everyone's job is important. We all help in different ways. Hmm. Daniel, what's the matter? I really wanted to be the line leader. I see. Being lunch helper is an important job, too. Everyone's job is important. We all help in different ways. But I wanted to help by being the line leader. You will get to be line leader another week. But for this week, we'll need your help when it's lunchtime and we're all hungry. Lunch helper is a very important job. Okay. Hi, Daniel. I'm off to water the plants. It's my job. Woohoo! Want to come with me? Okay. Come with us. Snifty go lifty. Here you go, plants. Delicious water to drink. <laughs> Everyone's job is important. We all help in different ways. Hooray! I'm all done, Teacher Harriet. I watered the plants. Wonderful, O. Now the plants will get big and strong because you did your job. O is helping the plants grow? That is an important job. Shake that tail. <laughs> Bunny playtime? Snowball's having fun. Now hop up and down. Lift those paws. I added that part to my job. And to give him water so he's not thirsty. Snack time, Snowball. He won't want to help give Snowball a snack. He needs three pieces of lettuce. Sure. You help, too. Count three pieces of lettuce with me. One, One two, two, three. three. Look at him munch that lettuce. I'm helping Snowball grow big and strong. It's my job. Everyone's job is important. We all help in different ways. Snowball is the best bunny in the world. Everyone, come take a seat for lunchtime. Time to go to the table. Please line up behind the line leader, which is me. Here I come. <laughs> I'm royally hungry. I am one hungry tiger. I'm so hungry I could eat my lunch. Meow, meow. Um, ah. hmm. Woohoo. Where are all of our lunches? The lunch helper didn't do his job. Now we have no lunch. Sorry, Tommy. The lunch helper? Wait a minute. <gasps> That's me! I'm the lunch helper! No one got their lunch because I didn't do my job. Being lunch helper is an important job. Without me, there's no lunch. Teacher Harriet, I'm ready to hand out lunches. I need to do my job. Everyone's job is important. We all help in different ways. I'm so glad to hear that, Daniel. The book lunchbox for O. Thanks, Daniel. Ballet lunchbox for Katerina. Meow, meow, thank you. Royal crown lunchbox for Prince Wednesday. Thanks. And museum go rail lunchbox for Miss Elena. Thanks, Toots. Aw, oh, yum. Oh, and a tiger lunchbox for me. Daniel, 
Because I'm one hungry tiger. Everyone's job is important. We all help in different ways. Everyone's job is important. We all help in different ways. I'm in charge of turning off the lights because we don't need them when we go to bed. I set the table. around our class. We can put away toys and pick up trash. When we each do our part each day, things will run smoothly in every way. Everyone's job is important. We all help in different ways. Everyone's job is important. We all help in different ways. We all help out in different ways. My dad is fixing stuff today, and we're fixing my playhouse. Just for pretend. I'm using my tools from my Tiger-tastic tool belt. And uh, I have lots of tools in my Nifty the Lifty toolbox. See my tools inside? Will you help us? All right, Daniel and O. What should we fix on your playhouse? We need to... Fix the doorbell. Ooh, yes, the doorbell. The doorbell won't ding dong. Just for pretend. Okay. You two fix the doorbell, and I'll be over here working on the house. Roar if you need me. Okay. Let's fix the doorbell. <laughs> Sit together. together. Too loud, too loud. Which tool should I use? How about the hammer? Okay. I have my hammer too. Woohoo! Okay, let's fix the doorbell. You help too. Say, hammer, hammer, hammer. Hammer, hammer, hammer. Hammer, hammer, hammer. Hammer, hammer! Too loud. Hoo -hoo, too loud. Okay, all done. All done. Phew. Oh, good. Let's see if we fix the doorbell. Ding, ding dong, ding, ding dong. dong. We fixed it together. together. Too loud. Loud, too loud. Hoo hoo. You two have really been working hard over here. Nice job. High fives all round. Hey, want to go inside and fix something else? Yes, nifty the lifty. Oh, look. Trolley needs to be fixed. Trolley needs to be fixed? Just for pretend, right? Yes, just for pretend. Hey. We can use our hammers to fix trolley, too. Our hammers? Uh, again? Are you sure you don't want to use another tool? A screwdriver. It's nice and quiet. No, I don't think so. Or, or a wrench. Wrenches are nice and quiet. No, I think we need the hammer. Oh, OK. The hammer, yes. Hoo hoo. Terrific. You help, too. Hammer, hammer, hammer. Hammer, hammer, hammer. Hammer, hammer, hammer. Too loud, Daniel, too loud. Hammer, hammer, hammer. We're fixing trolley. Hammer, hammer. <laughs> Come on, O. Let's hammer. Too loud. Hoo -hoo. Too loud. Hammer, hammer, oh. hammer. What are we working on in here? Hammer, hammer, hammer. Oh, what's the matter? Daniel is hammering too, too loud. Hammer. Too loud, hoo hoo. It, it hurts my ears. Why aren't you hammering, O? Daniel, the hammering is too loud for O. It's hurting my ears. But it doesn't hurt my ears. I like hammering loud. I understand that you like hammering loud, but it's too loud for O. Can you think about a time when something was too loud for you? Too loud for me? Okay. I'm thinking about when Miss Elena was being too loud. She kept saying beep, beep, beep right in my face. It made me feel upset. You were upset. So now can you use empathy and think about how O the owl is feeling? Empathy? Empathy is when you think about how someone else is feeling. Think about how someone else is feeling. Hmm. Do you feel upset, O? 
ear. Hammering is too loud. It makes me jump. Who? I'm sorry, O. I'll hammer softer. Thanks, Daniel. Hoo hoo. Now that is empathy, because you're thinking about how your friend feels. <laughs> Mr. Owl, what are you doing? Oh, hello, Daniel. I don't feel very well. I'm closing up the library today and go to see Dr. Anna. Oh, no. I, I know. If I'm not here to run the library, no one will get their, their books. <laughs> oh, excuse me. The most important thing is for you to get better, X. We can help run the library while you're at Dr. Anna's. Right, Mom? I think that's a wonderful idea. Thank you so much. <laughs> oh, excuse me. All you have to do is put away the stack of books on my desk, and if anyone comes in to borrow a book, make sure you stamp it with the date so they know when to bring it back. Oh, when you hear the cuckoo clock chime, it's closing time. We can do that. We'll take care of things here and check on you later. Don't worry about a thing. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, bless oh, you. Sorry. Bye, feel better. Goodbye. Okay, Mom. If anyone comes in to get a book, I'll be like a real librarian. <laughs> Great idea, Daniel. And I'll put away the stack of books. <laughs> well, hey there, X the Owl. <laughs> you look different today. I'm not X the Owl. I'm Daniel Tiger. X the Owl has a cold, so we're helping out at the library. X has a cold? Well, that's too bad. Good thing he has friends like you to help him out. Thanks. Do you need a book? I do. I need a, a book of music. I want to learn some new songs so I can play for the neighbors. I love playing music for everyone. It's part of a music man's job. Oh, yeah. I like it when you play music. It makes everyone so happy. Everyone's job is important. We all help in different ways. Well, when you get your book, I'll stamp it for you. It's my job today anyway. Sounds like a plan. I'll be right back. All right, that stack of books is all put away. Good job, Mom. Found just the book I needed. Wonderful. And now Mr. Librarian here can help you check that book out. Book, please. Stamp. Now you know when to bring the book back. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Catch you later. Bye, Music Man Stan. Bye, Music Man Stan. What do we do next? Okay, now it's time to play Kick the Ball. Boy, Miss Elena, you know a lot about picnics. I sure do, tits. <laughs> <laughs> Pass me the ball. Okay, ready? Kick! Whoa! Da da da! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Da da da! Yeah! I've got it! I've got it! I've. Uh oh. <gasps> uh oh. What happened? Oh, that's not working. Look, our ball is squish, squash, splat. That's not good. So. We can't play kick the ball on our picnic? Oh, no. Grr. Oh, no. Do I hear a sad grr? What's wrong? Our ball. It's squashed. See? Squish, squash, splat! And now we can't play kick the ball. Oh, I see. Yes, a squashed ball. That is very disappointing. But, you know what I always say? When something seems bad, turn it around and find something good. When something seems bad, a squash ball is bad. <laughs> yes. Now, turn it around and... Find something good? What's good about a squash ball that you can't even kick? Well, what else could you do with a squished, squashed, splat ball? Um, we can't kick it, so we could... Throw it? Daniel Tiger, catch! Flat. Got it! Grr. Nice throw. <gasps> a squash ball is good for playing? Splat ball! <laughs> Here you go! Splat! <laughs> splat ball! <laughs> Woohoo! Splat, uh. splat, splat! <laughs> splat. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. splat! Splat, splat, splat! <laughs> splat ball! <laughs> I felt a 
raindrop on my nose. <gasps> I shot a raindrop on my tongue. I, Prince Wednesday, royally command the rain to stop. Rain, rain, go away. Come, Come again, again another, another day. day. No way, Toots. It is not going to... Quick! Let's run inside the clock factory. Zoom, 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 zoom! Phew! We made it inside. <laughs> but now, our picnic is ruined! I'm so disappointed. But do you remember what you can do when you're disappointed? When something seems bad, turn it around and find something good. But there's nothing good. Grrr! <gasps> Whoa! It's chime time! That clock looks like your castle, Prince Wednesday. And this one is a tiger like me! <laughs> Amazing! I have a royally good idea. Can we have our picnic inside with all the clocks? That would be something good. Fantastic! You turned that rainy picnic around and found something good. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Put it here. An inside picnic. I love it, Toots. I'm not disappointed anymore. Me neither. Me neither. This is terrific. Mm. We try to have our picnic with storm clouds overhead, but it's still dry inside, and now it's chime time instead. When something seems bad, turn it around and find something good. Once I built a sand castle way up into the sky, but a wave knocked it down, so I made a mud pie. When something seems bad, turn it around and find something good. I love to wear my favorite dress since I love the color red. Once I saw it wasn't clean, I wore my red socks instead. When something seems bad, turn it around and find something good. When something seems bad, Swim, we swim, swim. <laughs> hey, wanna pretend to swim with me? <laughs> Come on. Swim, swim, swim. I can't wait to go to the beach. Swimming, swimming, swimming. Swim, we swim, swim, swim. Swim, swim, swim. Hey, I have an idea. Let's make believe we're swimming with the fish in the deep blue sea. For us to see. Wasn't that terrific? Daniel, Daniel, Daniel! When we get to the beach, I'm going to build a great big sandcastle! Me too! I can't wait to go outside and play! <gasps> oh no! It's raining! Ready to go outside? Oh, wow! Look, it's raining. We can't go outside if it's raining. Why not? Well, because this much rain will make you soaked and cold. And the sand is all soggy. I can't go outside to play on the beach? That makes me so mad! Roar! I'm mad too! Royal Grump! Me too. Grr. It's okay to be mad. Roar! What can we do now? I'm too mad! Well, first we need to stay calm so we can figure out what to do. When you feel so mad that you want to roar, take a deep breath and count to four. 
One, two, three, four. Now you. Would you do it with me? Okay. When you feel so mad that you want to roar, take a deep breath and count to four. One, One two, two, three, four. How do you feel? Better. I do feel calmer, but I'm still mad. But now that you're calm, you can think of what to do. What should we do? Yeah, I royally wonder what we can do. Let's put our heads together to think. So, Daniel, what do you think we should do? Well, we want to play at the beach, but we can't go outside. So what if we make a beach <gasps> inside? Inside beach day. Good idea. Will you help us make a beach inside? You will? Great. Let's think about what we need. We have sand pails and shovels. Terrific. Now we need a sun for our inside beach. <gasps> Let's go to my room. Good idea. <laughs> <laughs> Do you see anything that looks like a sun? Let me know when you see a sun. Over here. Whoa. Look. The sun I'm in at school. I made it out of a paper plate. And yellow, yellow, <laughs> yellow paint. <laughs> we have our sun. What else do we need for our inside beach? Think, think, think. Uh, maybe some shells? Okay. Let me know when you see shells. Shells! It will look so beachy. <laughs> what else do we need for our inside beach? Hmm. Sand! Come on! Let's use some sand from right outside. There's a dry sand spot underneath the porch. We're setting up an inside beach. Yeah! We're setting up an inside beach. Yeah! Let's set up the inside beach. Let's put the sun here. And the shells will go here, and here, and here. Look! I will put two beach chairs facing our pretend deep blue sea. And our sand pails and shovels go right here. We're setting up an inside beach. Yeah! Let's add the sand to our inside beach. We're setting up an inside beach. Yeah! An inside beach. <gasps> My word! What are you doing with those buckets of sand inside the house? Boy, Mom, your cheeks are red. And your face looks funny. Are you mad? I am mad. Sand is for outside. Oh, I must calm down. When you feel so mad that you want to roar, take a deep breath and count to four. One, two, three, four. Okay, I feel calmer now. Good job, Mom. Thank you, Daniel. Now, why is there sand inside the house? Because we wanted to make an inside beach. Oh, right, okay. But real sand is not for a pretend inside beach. See the house? Real sand makes such a big mess on the floor. But how can we make an inside beach without sand? That makes me so angry. Grr. Daniel, remember the song? When you feel so mad that you want to roar, take a deep breath <gasps> and count to four. You count to one, two, three, four. four. Okay, I'm calmer now. Nice job, Daniel and <laughs> Prince Wednesday. <sighs> Thank you. We want to make an inside beach with sand. Yeah. With sand. An inside beach is a good idea, but what else can we use for sand? I know. Let's think. You know what, Daniel? We made a sun out of paper plates and yellow paint in school. Yeah? So, do you think we could make sand out of something else? Good idea. And please put the pails of sand back outside. Okay. <laughs>
And, and, and sweep up the sand, too, please. Okay. Only scoop up the sand, will ya? Scoop, 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 scoop! Scoop, 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 scoop! So what could we use that looks like sand? Is there anything that is the color of sand? Maybe these blankets could be sand and water. <gasps> blankets for sand and water? Good idea. Let's try it. Cool. And I could put the shells on top of the blanket. Oh, I mean, sand. <laughs> Great. And the pails and shovels go on top of the sand, too. That's awesome. Inside beach with blankets for sand and water. Royally great! Let's play at our inside beach. Swim, swim, swim. Scoop, scoop, scoop. Hello, Daniel. Ooh, hello, Daniel. Hello, neighbor. Rain, rain is here today. Let's go outside so we can play. Play is so much fun. Nifty go lifty day for the boys to play in the rain, but I'm ready to go back to my nice dry nest. Okay, we'll see you later. Yes, <clears throat> have a bit fun. Bye bye. Bye. -bye. Woo Come on, let's play. Woo rain, rain is here today. Let's go outside so we can play. Look, go! I'm a frog. Watch me jump! Ribbit! <laughs> Nifty go lifty! Daniel, I'm a frog too! Ribbit! Ribbit! Puddle! Don't you want to jump in a puddle? You can make a big splash! Like this! Ready? One! Two! Three! Whee! Hmm, okay. Hoo-hoo. I think I can make a little splash. Watch. Splash! Splash! Let me try that one one more time. Woohoo! One, two, three. Woohoo! Whoa! <laughs> Owls are excellent splashers. <laughs> oh, you're funny. Hey, yo! Wanna jump in a puddle together? Okay, woohoo. One, two, three. Let's go outside so we can play. <laughs> <laughs> that was loud. Who oh, no. That's scary. Time to come inside now, boys. <laughs> okay, let's get you out of these wet things. Here we go. Nice and dry. So, did you boys have fun? Uh-uh. You didn't? What's wrong? We were playing, and then it got dark. And then it went boom! And we got scared. Oh, okay, okay. Let's get you cozy in the living room so we can talk about this. Okay. Ah! There's the boom again! It's so loud! Now, that sound is thunder. Yeah, thunder can be loud during a rainstorm. I don't like thunder. No, not at all. Hoo-hoo! I know thunder is loud, but you're inside and safe. I know. But thunder is scary. There's something I do when I'm scared. You get scared? Grown-ups get scared? Oh, yes. Grown-ups get scared, too. Sometimes. So what do you do when you're scared? When you're scared, close your eyes and think of something happy. Thinking about something happy helps me feel a little better. Oh, oh no! More thunder! The thunder can't hurt you. Try thinking of something happy. Okay, I'll try. When you're scared, close your eyes and think of something happy. Okay, Daniel, what makes you happy? Uh, playing with Tiggy. Is it working? Do you feel less scared? Yes, I don't feel as scared anymore. Come on, you try it out. Try thinking about something happy. Hmm, let me think. When you're scared, close your eyes and think of something happy. What makes me happy? 
Reading books makes me happy. Do you feel a little less scared now, too, Woo -hoo. I do. But I still wish the thunderstorm would stop. Hoo-hoo. Yeah, rain is only good when we can jump in puddles. You know, there are a lot of other good things about the rain. Like what? Hoo-hoo. Want to know more about rain? There's a book for that. Rain makes trees grow, and rain makes grass grow, and rain makes flowers grow. Wow. Hmm. I wonder if all of the flowers and trees are really happy in the rain. Because they're growing. Hey, do you want to make believe with me? Let's make believe that the trees and the grass and everything are singing in the rain. Okay, boys, what do you say? Are you ready to play right here in the house? Yes! Ooh, okay. Okay, good. I'll be in the kitchen. Roar or hoo hoo if you need me. Thanks, Mom! Hi, honey. What's that? A letter from Grand Père. It made Dad really happy. Hmm. Well, Dad loves getting letters from people he cares about. Hmm. Mom, do you think Dad would like getting a letter from me? Hmm, he would love a letter from you. Making something is one way to say I love you. Hey, I can make Dad a letter with a picture and send it to him, just like Grand Père's letter. Making something is one way to say I love you. There, I drew a heart because I love Dad. Will you write the words? All right. Dear Dad. Dear Dad. This heart is for you. Love, Daniel. Love, Daniel. Did you write that? I did. Now, let's get your letter ready to mail. OK. <laughs> First, your letter has to go in an envelope. Careful, careful. Yes, carefully. Want to lick the envelope? Yes. Envelope. OK, funny. <laughs> Okay, now we write down our address, so our postman, Mr. McFeely, knows where the letter is going. To our mailbox. We live on Jungle Beach. That's right. Now we need a stamp. Well, I like this one. Okay. Great. Now let's take it to the post office. Let's make it a surprise for Dad. Dad loves surprises. <laughs> to the post office. Daniel and I are going out. We'll be back soon. <laughs> Dad <laughs> loves surprises. Shh, 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 shh. Okay, see you later. We're baking them. It's the letter I made. Making something is one way to say I love you. Did I just hear Mr. McFeely's voice out here? Yup, you did. Um, did you want to look in the mailbox and see if there are any new letters or anything? Uh, okay. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> looky here, it's a letter for me. <laughs> It must be my lucky day. <laughs> yep. Hmm. I wonder who it's from. Now, let me see. Fantastic! Dear, Dear Dad, Dad, this, this heart, heart is, is for, for you. you. Love, Love, Daniel. Daniel, did you make me this letter? I did. Are you happy? 
Oh, Daniel, this picture makes me so happy. I made it for you because I love you. Making something is one way to say I love you. I love you too. <laughs> I could make up a song to say. Anything good in the mail today? Oh, yes, there sure was. I got a surprise. A letter from a very special tiger. Dad was surprised. You know, I think you're both very special tigers. Hmm. <laughs> My dad really liked the letter I made him. Maybe you can make something to say I love you. A letter or a picture or even a song.